Hi everybody, this is Titi Readings and this reading is going to be for Libra. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages that will pop out for you guys. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Check out the link in the description box, Libra. It's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking, feeling about you? Their next moves towards you outcome of the situation between the two of you advice oracle messages love notes messages from the universe okay messages from your parson a bit about your finances you can also check out your 2021 forecast okay so both of those videos will be in the description box i see disappointment i see sadness about a past situation but we will see what about libra what do we have for libra you see the nine of swords again so i think um something about this past situation has changed you've got the death card the queen of swords <sighs> mm -hmm. so there's silence right now between you and this person libra something is bothering you okay you're not really showing it but it is bothering you um overall i do see big changes happening here and i actually see it i actually see a shift in the energy for you i see you getting your confidence back i see you being assertive about your needs your wants so you're putting yourself first you're trying to be happy you're trying to follow your passion and there's some sort of a stress here there's some sort of a stress we will see what is it about but there's sadness okay and to me it looks like there's not much you can do about it as in this is about a situation that yes you want it to improve but you feel like you haven't got any power over the situation okay you guys are counterparts to one another got the king of wands the death card again could be dealing with a scorpio pisces taurus leo we have the two of cups so your person really wants to communicate with you from what I see here. Um, I think you both have a lot of passion for one another, okay? But for some reason, I'm also picking up on an energy that this connection seems to be very on and off, okay? And, you know, you feel like as much as you want this, you, you're just tired of something. So it almost looks like you're tired of feeling a certain way. You're tired of things being a certain way. Okay. And it's kind of creating that conflict here. I see you being very focused on yourself, on your independence, on your happiness, okay? But I also see that there is something that you would like more closure on, okay? I do see financial independence. I do see some sort of an investment here. What is it that is tiring you out? We've got the Ten of Swords, the Nine of Swords, so possibly this ending, okay? something has emotionally or mentally drained you so bad that you're just letting it go you're like and to me it even looks like you feel like you haven't got any par over this situation anymore okay so yes you want things to move forward but it's, it's almost like that feeling of what can i do about it you know i hope that the other person is feeling the same way about me because what can i do about it okay I think it was here, okay. Whoever you're connecting with really wants to communicate with you, okay? And the love here is mutual, Libra, with the Four of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Love is mutual. You both want this. You both want to talk. But there is a burden from the past. There is some, sort of um, some sort of hesitation, okay, coming from the past. I see you focused on yourself, Libra. Some of you are very focused on your money, taking control back. 
but I see lots of forward movement here that you're expecting with this person but you know that is not what you're showing on the outside on the outside you're showing that you know I'm fine but on the inside you're really hoping that you two can communicate again I do see it's a it's a mindset where you're very focused on your life um you're hard working you're focusing on yourself but Again, this is somebody you love and this is somebody you would love to connect with again. And if this is not somebody you want in your life, this could be about, you know, you wanting to be in a relationship, something like that. Because I do see you thinking about something, but you're very silent. It almost looks like you're silently going through something. You're not talking about it, but deep down inside, I see lots of emotions. You're still expecting um to hear from this person you're expecting forward movement okay and so are they love is mutual here but i don't know why is it telling me that something started between the two of you but it ended before it even started so you guys maybe made a plan and you guys didn't meet okay something like that i see lots of um silence here on your pod it almost looks like you're you're looking within yourself you're taking a break to realize what is it that you can do <clears throat> but again i see you under some sort of a mental stress here it could be about your work as well it almost looks like something you want isn't happening okay other things might be going fine but there's that one thing that's not happening and it's bothering you now, I do see lots of forward movement, Libra, in your finances with the Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles energy. This is major abundant energy, okay? This is lots of good opportunities and, you know, saving money, being able to move forward. This is even a relationship, okay? But like I said, I do see lots of financial movement. I see you getting recognition in your work. I see success. I see victory. Something that other people will recognize, okay? Now, the Tower, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands. You know what? I see a new beginning. I see things picking up pace again. I see a passion, a passionate new beginning, okay? And it's all going to happen so fast that you're not even going to get a chance to con contemplate or think what happened here. So... I think you two are going to be with one another again and it's going to happen so fast. Like I said, you're not even going to know what happened. Look at that. Four of Wands fell for you. So again, I, I see a relationship. Okay. I see commitment. I see lots of forward movement. Something very passionate resulting in a relationship. So I feel like this person wants to be in a relationship with you, Libra. This is marriage. This is even about um, like some sort of a movement, okay, about your, I don't know, some sort of a stable forward movement. This is you entering a new phase in your life. I see prosperity coming your way. I see balance. Um, but I see, um, I think that things are going to change for you really rapidly here. And to me, it is also looking like a change that you're looking forward to so a happy family lots of forward movement somebody's gonna get um married proposed wanting to be in a relationship or kids could be involved as well for some of you but i see a successful relationship and lots of forward movement okay and it's happening fast Okay, so look at that Wheel of Fortune Tower and the Four of Wands. So again, it is like um, things are changing for you. You might not see it coming, but things are changing for you. And, it, and it's a very nice change. It's not a change that is, oh my goodness, you know, disrupting everything. It's a very nice change. Look at that. You've got the King of Cups and the Page of Wands. Um... Whoever you're dealing with, Libra, this person really wants to talk to you, okay? King of Cups, Two of Cups, Page of Wands, Eight of Wands, lots of communication. And it almost looks like this person wants to say something. You might get, you know, communication from them. We're getting lots of wands here. So it could be, I'm going to say the signs towards the end, but 
yeah ace of swords and the knight of cups at the bottom see this is somebody things have ended you, you have ended things with or maybe they ended but this is something that wasn't moving forward in the past but i see it moving forward in the future for sure knight of cups ace of swords your person's hoping for clarity and i think so are you okay you both want to say something there's something left unsaid here that should be spoken okay expression of feelings is what i heard so somebody's going to be expressing themselves okay now there might have been some game playing energy at times you feel like this person tends to not be honest with you but libra let me tell you something this person feels the same way about you okay so whoever wasn't honest i don't know if it was you or them the other person feels like they should be more honest about their feelings okay this person really wants to talk like i don't know how many times am i going to say this but there's lots to look forward to okay so something in your life might have ended but it's not permanent like i said some sort of an ending is bringing you a new beginning and it's coming in with lots of passion you know a desire to take things forward again the signs that are here are aries cancer scorpio pisces aries leo sag then we have uh aquarius and gemini too taurus is here too with a bit of leo so we've got a lot of signs let's see check out the link in the description box libra it's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with how are they thinking feeling about you their next moves towards you outcome of the situation between the two of you advice oracle messages love notes uh, where is this headed towards as well as messages from the universe for you so do check it out i'll be linking it below it's time to release um some negativity and what do you need to release so you're getting the word release twice there is some sort of a negative attachment here there is something that you're keeping within your i apologize libra i got cut off i don't know why that happened but it's time to release some negativity what is it that you're carrying within yourself libra that you need to release okay um it could be something related to stress okay you're stressing about something a whole lot with the nine of swords here okay but this is something that you need to release and then again you know conclusions are within reach so i see the situation resolving but there's something that you need to let go of as well let me see what fell on the floor for you wow okay so a win-win outcome is forecast which is a libra card so i i see victory i see forward movement and i see success for you especially when it comes to money some sort of a big project some sort of a big opportunity i even see a residential move if that is what you're planning or you know investing something like that let's see do check out the link in the description box libra it's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with and your 2021 forecast will also be linked below so see engagement separation so i still see getting to know one another so i feel like you are going to be communicating with somebody and this is somebody you are in separation with uh soulmate and a hot talk conversation you both want to talk to one another and this is a soulmate connection libra which kind of explains why you both are not able to let go of one another okay um but there needs to be more honesty about expression of feelings like i said you know somebody needs to express themselves um honestly with the engagement and the separation energy i do see you know your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment some of you could be married to this person or will be getting married and if that is not the case this could be just you know a stable commitment coming your way because i do feel like there's lots you know there's lots here telling me about a commitment with a win-win outcome with the six of wands four of wands ten of pentacles this is marriage this is commitment okay so you know it doesn't have to be this month but overall i do see you being in a relationship and i le and i see lots of forward movement for you okay but you need to work on releasing something because whatever it is that you're not releasing is creating a blockage for you it's kind of like 
uh, creating a blockage over the obvious, okay? So that's about it. Those were the energies that popped out for Libra. Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. Check out the link in the description box. It's going to take you through the extended for further clarifications about the person you're connecting with. How are they thinking and feeling about you? Their next moves, outcome, advice, love notes, and what is coming up for you later in the future with a bit about your finances and, you know, also going to be pulling out advice for you and what does your person want to say. So do check it out. It will be linked below as well as your 2021 forecast. Take care and bye-bye.